out here in uh, Houston, uh, Thursday before Houston Supercross, just signing autographs at Dodge dealership. They got a freestyle motocross demo going on and just hanging out the fans. Well, we're here in Houston for a uh, RCH Racing uh, autograph session, local Dodge dealership here in Houston, and uh, went pretty good. You know, it's uh, that's what it's about. Now it's uh, straight business. Tomorrow we'll go to the the stadium, uh, check out the track, do a couple things business-wise. I got a few TV meetings uh, to get ready for Saturday's race at uh, at uh, Reliance Stadium. Can't wait to get there. It's going to be good. We got some momentum going, and uh, just thank thank everybody for. Uh, coming out tonight and uh, and hopefully hopefully they enjoyed their time we are setting the tent up this is the all legendary all world RCH Dodge Saquon hospitality slash marketing tent People write magazine articles about what goes on here. Every year they expect something new and exciting from Barton Huntington slash RCA. And this year they're gonna get it and I'm gonna build it right now. Well, I'm not really gonna build it. Jerry and Chris will. Yeah, so we're going to, uh, going to the like a little briefing with Feld about the 2013 Monster Energy Cup. Obviously everybody knows I designed that track and you know I really got my hands on it so it's been an honor to be able to do that. Since I've retired and, and still staying involved with the sport and trying to do cool things and and really give back you know th th these are the things I do stuff like that so it's fun it's what I love to do and still be involved give back and and, and still be pretty influential in some, uh, in some things that go on. We're walking up right now to go film the guys. That way they can watch the, the video after practice. See, see what we got, you know, how they're looking. Uh, good day. I mean, everything went pretty good. I was ninth in the first practice, eighth in the second practice, uh, third in the heat, which was my best heat race I've you know done all year, and then uh, was seventh the whole main. And Andrew Short got me in the last corner, and I got eighth. So top ten. I mean, I'm happy, but I still feel like I have a, a lot, you know, a lot further to go, and uh, I feel like I have it in the tank. It's it's not like I need to find it. I just need to bring it to the races on the weekend. 
think uh, for us having a bad weekend getting tenth isn't isn't too bad. But uh, we're on the next weekend and uh, have a good week this week and uh, get back home in California and get some, get some riding in. Maybe ride outdoors one day and uh, see what we can do. Well, it's over, Houston. It was fun. Uh, I think uh, tonight, all in all, went pretty well. It was the first time we've ever finished uh, both guys in the top ten. Uh, Josh ended up uh, eighth, which was pretty good. He was in seventh the whole race and kind of, you know, got passed at the end, which kind of sucked, but it's all good. And then uh, Brock had a pretty rough night all all together, but uh, salvaged tenth. Uh, had a little controversy with uh, a guy that he's been having problems with all year, but hopefully. We uh, figured it out, and uh, that's all going to go away. And uh, these guys can be professionals and, and treat each other with respect, which hasn't been going on in both directions. So we'll see what happens. Um, boys will be boys. So uh, we're off to Minneapolis, and uh, the saga continues. <laughs>